about education, you know, with the Nigerian and how it is that, that the Nigerian youth are actually doing? Uh, education is uh, literally uh, to develop individuals to become useful to themselves and they are also useful to the nation. So you can see that uh, individuals required uh, have skills to be able to be useful to themselves and also be useful to the nation. And uh, the bulk of the population uh, are useful. So that is why education is very, very important in terms of imparting skills that will be useful to the nation. Because you need uh, professionals in different fields to develop the nation. So, and uh, uh, the bulk of those that are uh, supposed to be educated as a youth, uh, when you consider uh, the growing uh, use of child, you have people that will be growing through schooling from Nursery, primary, secondary, and uh, tertiary institutions. Have to work up uh, there to become adults, become professionals, to develop education skills. Yeah, so education is very, very important. I'm asking you this question particularly as regards the performance of young Nigerians in your examination. I mean, this, does this give any hope? And is this, is this a, is there a ray of hope for the Nigerian youth vis-a-vis, -vis, you know, building skills, young people building skills? We have Nigerians, you know, uh, who the youth population is about the bulk of the population that we have. Uh, of course, you see, since the inceptions of the National Examinations Council, uh, the youth started writing legal examinations in 2000. So between 2000 and 2022, more than 31 million uh, uh, youths, Nigerian youths, wrote uh, uh, NACO examinations. So you have all of these populations that are professionals. A lot number of them are professors, a lot number of them are engineers, they are doctors, they are pharmacists. In fact, in every field, in the security sector, you have a lot number of them that uh, 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 grow up and become professionals in these fields. So, as far as uh, uh, NIPO is concerned, the service we are rendering is very, very important. And the youth are, are growing. They are growing. And the nation is uh, 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 benefiting from okay. a lot more. In terms of policies, I mean, what does government need to do differently to ensure that youths, you know, who actually acquire the skills are also provided to be, you know, employable? Well, the government supposed to have a kind of uh, state of emergency for the youth in Nigeria because uh, if you look at the unemployment uh, uh, index, the bulk of the, uh, that are the youths. So we need to declare a kind of state of emergency as far as uh, 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 the uh, policy of youth is concerned because the backbone of any nation is, uh, is the, even for an ancient, uh, ancient period. So we must have a program where we engage the youth to develop skills useful to themselves and be useful uh, to the nation. Rather than just uh, 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 palliative measures in terms of uh, 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 just uh, stop uh, a kind of program where uh, after such program uh, 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 it ends here. Uh, just like uh, uh, the program we have to show, just like the, the box uh, scheme, it has uh, died. And this is not the kind of program that uh, the youth in Nigeria need. We need a sustainable program of developing the youth. Because if it, is, it is only when we do that that we, we understand the importance of the youth in nation, uh, uh, nation. of management, staff, and all Nigerian children and youths that write NACO examinations, I'm glad to launch this book with an undisclosed amount for 20 copies. Thank you. 20 copies is not